Assalamu alaikum. Welcome children to my channel. Okay. Today I want to tell you a very frequently asked question about class notifications. I get many emails and comments that students want to know why ma'am we are not getting notifications. Even in yesterday's class, even many students in class 6th and 8th were asking about it. So I'm trying to solve the problem via the WhatsApp numbers. They are calling me through their WhatsApps or personal messages. But then I don't want that only few limited people solve their problem. I want each one of you solve this problem once for all. So what you have to do simply check. I will tell you steps. Step one, you will go here and you will check your sync is on or off. This should be like this. It should be on. This is synchronization button, right? This means that your email account is synced with all other accounts. Wherever you have opened your email account, it gets synchronized with each other. Fine. Also check is your this mobile data on because we are working on our mobile data right now, right? Okay, fine. After this, you are done with this one. Open your email, Gmail we are using with the uh, our uh, Google Classroom. You know that with our Google Classroom, I'm mostly using Gmail account. So I'll open my Gmail account like this and I will try to find the account which I'm actually using with my Google Classroom. So I'm using this one with my Google Classroom. So what I will do here, I will go to the settings okay i will check all my accounts and i will check this one this account because this one is linked with my google classroom so notifications are all so i'm getting notifications for all the messages which come up and these this options list should be like this okay all should be checked check means it should have a tick over there that means it is checked and for, for notifications it should be all priority wise not but all all the notifications should be come up okay fine you're done with this go back okay and then go to your final destination that is your google classroom see this is my google classroom this this will look like same in your account as well so what you have to go you have to do you have to click over here and you have to check the settings again in the settings you have two options here that sync or mobile data do you want to synchronize or mobile data mobile data means that for example for example you're not using any uh, activity you're not doing any activity during the uh, during some time but if mobile data is off then you will not get notifications so you have you don't have to keep it off you have to keep it on and send email notifications yes and class notifications should be on for the classes you want notifications from for example i was teaching till may i was teaching class 9th and 10 now we have a rotation i am teaching class 6th and 8th so i have kept the notifications for class 9th and 10th off and i have kept the notifications for classes 6th and 8th on because i am teaching those classes right now so i'm not bothered about the other classes so i want the notifications from the same classes so you have to keep the class notifications on from the classes you want okay then going back see this should look like this okay this should be done and this is it you if you do this and after doing this you just have to refresh your uh, mobile your device you are using for google classroom and i think the problem will be solved in further sum, if the problem is not solved after refreshing also, I think it will be solved because I have helped many students like that. So what you will do is you will go into the settings and in settings you can see the apps. Okay. And in apps you will find the app like uh, Gmail where you will clear the cache and also you can find the apps uh, namely Google Classroom where you will clear the cache. And then again refresh your uh, smartphone or Android, whatever you're using, and then the problem will be solved. I think you should try this 
patiently go by step by step and the problem will be solved. If it's not solved, then there are two options. Either you have to try using the same Gmail account, same account in some other phone. Maybe it, it's some other fault, which is not with the app, it's not with the technical fault, some other fault. Okay? So we can do that also. And if there are any problems, you can just write to me, email to me, and I will try to solve the problems. Thank you and have a nice day. Allah Hafiz.